So if you believe in fate, I believe no, there's no accidents. I firmly believe there's no accidents. And I believe in uh, you know having guardians and guides and God and all these wonderful things too. So I go in and I go up the staircase and it was on the. I thought it was the second. I think it's the second floor. So I'm in a stairwell between the first and second floor. Should I go up? Should I go? I knew the apartment number. At least an hour I was standing there. And then all of a sudden this woman comes who looks like this character. She had two shopping bags. And in Italian, I had my little speech spread. And in Italian, I said, excuse me, I'm looking for uh, Signora Augustino. And I knew that that was the uh, cognome, cognome, uh, the, the surname of the mother. In Italian, she said, that's me. I'm like, okay. So I said, well, I told her my name. I told her I was from the United States. I said I was born, but I was born in Italy in Iosta, the birth date, my birth date, and, I, and I'm your son. And she's like, no, no. I said, well, I know we ha I have an older brother. His name is this, and he was born in this day, and an older sister, her name was this. And now she's like, okay takes me into the apartment and shows me this picture of what looked to be like a seven-year-old and who looked a little bit like me, but it wasn't me because I left at 11 months, three weeks. Because <laughs> in Italian, this is you. I'm like, well, and to myself thinking, oh my God, I'm in the wrong house. <laughs> it just, it's all right. And then, and I said in Italian that, <clears throat> excuse me, I was, I left when I was almost one year old. And then I saw the wheels turning. And she nodded and she called Francesca, Francesca, and out emerges this young woman who looked to be a year or two older than me. And the, the woman says, who is this? And she said, it's your brother. And she said, Miguel. And the mother goes, no, the uh, another one. So they would have been too young to know, even know about me. Well, um, yeah, shock everybody. So my sister takes my arm and she says, okay, we're going to go. We have to meet your brother. And we go to the piazza and he was at the time selling, he was like working at a newsstand. The same conversation. Who's this? It's our brother. <laughs> Miguel? No, a younger, another one. I stayed there about a week in, in, a, in a hotel and spent most of my time with them. It was wonderful. It was good. It was, it was comfortable.